friends, welcome to Play It Meow. My name is Stephanie, and today we're going to continue our playthrough of Oxygen Not Included. <laughs> what, um, what do gas masks, what does it take to make them, I wonder? Let's look. Did I get that researched yet? Uh, ooh, clothing refashioner, snazzy. Um, textile loom. Where is the gas mask thing? Is that up? More? Oh, here it is. Here it is. Oxygen mask. Okay. Yeah. Let's research it. Let's see if we can find a good way. Natural gas. That geyser visits Taco Bell and Chipotle pretty frequently then. <laughs> it does. It absolutely does. I was saying in one of the other ones, um, I had this colony and I had all this natural gas and I could not figure out where it was coming from. I kept like piping it out and I was like, what is making natural gas? It was the duplicates. They were farting everywhere i had like two or three of them with the farts frequently trait and i did not realize that, <laughs> that it that just caused all this natural gas and so it was just stinking up my colony and i was like well uh, i'm just wrecking this one then <laughs> i'm going back to the main menu re-rolling <laughs> i'm not gonna continue <laughs> free power dupes <laughs> just lock them in a room with a vent and be like this is our power source all of you, we don't need coal, we don't need oil, we need Taco Bell. <laughs> I guess I didn't think of it that way, I was thinking of it more. <laughs> Not like, oh, this is a great source of power. <laughs> With great power comes great responsibility. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Is it still working? I think there's still a little more chlorine in there. We'll leave it going for now. That's great. <gasps> We've made we're almost gonna make new friends. Oh no, what happened to the other dragon? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> we didn't get there in time. Oh no. <laughs> we will remember you fondly when we eat you. I say very ominously. <gasps> Oh man, our food. Yes, yes, yes. Finally, our food is in a happier place. Thank goodness. Uh, I'm just gonna make a couple of gristle berries real quick. I feel like just checking that every so often. Oh, release, be free, run free with your friends. <laughs> How many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I don't know, I lost count, they all moved around. We will remember you fondly, mayhaps not as fondly as a cuddle pip, but it'll be on the list. <laughs> exactly, exactly. I can't wait for this to incubate too. I'm seeing so many new and fun things. But yes, if you were a glossy Draco, then I would be like, I would remember you most fondly. Move to here. Speaking of glossy Draco, I want a glossy Draco. I will have six to eight of them, and they will give me plastic. Uh, yeah, I can just build that right there, right? And just, then they'll hop over here and get to that. Yeah, okay, see, that'll be fine. Uh, medicine, man, we haven't had medicine in a while. Although, I feel like they haven't really been getting sick too horrifically often. Uh, thankfully. Now that we're kind of clearing out the pit of doom. Oh yeah, you you had me. You're gonna have me look at here at the gas. No, that's ox. Well, was this the overlay you were talking about to look at? When doing this one? Yeah. Oh, material overlay. That's what it was. Ah. Oh, that's horrifying. Oh no. Oh no. This gas? Just gas? Is that why? So many colors. I know. <laughs> that was terrifying. I never like looking at that, but this will be easier for us to picture then. Is the aha? Yes, yes, I see. See the water stopping the gas from moving past the lock. Yes. Yes. That is ingenious. But it still lets the little duplicates go through. Because they can just 
hop down like that. That is a really cool idea. Very, very nice. I'm so glad you shared that with me. So that is just, that's amazing. Cause I normally would just set up a ton of gas pumps and then just constantly be pumping gas back. And I'm just like, ugh, it's too much work. But this is great. This is exactly what we needed. And now we're not gonna have natural gas anywhere else, except right here, unless we get a farting duplicate. Some oxfern would thrive down there. You are right, I do have oxfern. I do have one. If the cuddles have, they already planted it. The pips have already planted it. I'm gonna uproot it. I'm gonna uproot it. Don't, don't, <gasps> it's kind of like an egg. So precious. Cuddled. <laughs> that is so precious. I'm gonna uproot these. I will put, don't plant that. Don't plant that. Nobody plant that. I'm moving it. They, they planted it already. <laughs> they planted it. Okay, pause. Did you pick it up? Did you pick it up? Did you pick... Where is it? Where did the oxford seed go? Where did it go? What did you do? Who has it? Open your mouth. <laughs> Where is it? Did a... Did a... Oh, they delivered it over. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I accused you. Alright? But you've got to admit, you were very suspicious. Alright, let's move this very quickly down here. Six. Okay. Eh, make that a seven. Make that an eight. <laughs> okay. And then I will get that out. And this one. We can move down at our leisure because no little pips are going to take it. Make that a six. All right. Oh yeah. Hey yeah. I want to show you guys the race car bed that I found. Uh, I don't have beds. Okay. First, we're gonna research the beds, and then I will show you the red race car bed that I unlocked because it is so cute. While we do this, did we art really just mop all of that? Is that all the stuff we have? Is that all the salt water? Hmm. Oh, we're not going to be able to reach that. Hmm. Well, maybe if I make a little ladder. Here, here you go. Make a little ladder. Oh, that's too much liquid. Uh, okay. Maybe not that. Let's take salt water from... Oh, now you guys have friends. You guys can make friends with each other now. Uh, where else? Oh, up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up here I got was access to the salt water. Here we go. Oh yeah, you're not gonna be able to do that. Oh, you were going after a wee's work to move into your base, start helping with cooling. Oh, thank you for reminding me. Thank you. You're right. I was. I was going after this one over here. Thank you for that. I get so darn distracted. I just have so much fun with all the things. And then I forget what the heck I'm doing. Where should we put that? Uh hmm. Maybe right here? Here? Here, maybe. That seems fine, just to do right there. We'll try it there. We'll see if we need it somewhere else. Uh, no. Not right now. I'm still paranoid that we're all gonna starve. <laughs> and that's not this game. And we were gonna try and get some Paku. But... Okay, all right. We've got this mopped up here. Did we... Oh, good, they already built that. My goodness, they were fast. All right, now we can start cooling down our base. This is awesome. Oh, I didn't mean to do the colony summary. I meant to do duplicate skills. Okay, and we have this, this. Uh, I don't know that we need that. Has anybody ever done, like the surfboard and stuff <laughs> like the any of like the really cool uh i've never done it any of the like the arcade thing the um the beach stuff like there's a beach chair isn't there isn't there a surfboard up here somewhere 
Oh yeah, there's a spa, a hot tub. Can we use that? Because we have that hot water geyser or cool steam vent or whatever it is. I wonder if the surfboard is pretty good. I've never used that. And hello, thank you for joining. I, I don't know, where did it go? Oh yeah, we have a steam turbine, a sauna. Man, these duplicates are gonna be spoiled. What are the, oh, a jukebox. I never done the jukebox either. Sadly, the beach chair is very difficult to get working right. Oh no, last time I played was before that stuff was introduced for the most part, but I've seen people show it off. <gasps> ah, maybe that, maybe the next time I stream, we should just, there should be like a recreation episode. <laughs> we should try to figure out mechanical surfboard. There it is. Some water gets splashed on the floor during use, increases duplicate morale. Maybe we should just have like a, a recreation thing and I can unlock, we'll try and figure out the arcade cabinet. We'll figure out the surfboard. We'll get the jukebox going. At some point after I get exosuits, we can get harness the hot water for a sauna. <laughs> that would be so fun. Man, those duplicates would be living life better than I am. Your whole ba base is a sauna. Why would you add in one? <laughs> I know, right? It is. It is really hot. That's the bad part. It's just so darn hot right there. Oh, there we go. Finally get the wheeze warts. We'll just take all the wheeze warts in here. We'll pluck them up. Repurpose them over here. Either that or we'll just have a ton of icy fans. <laughs> oh, man. Tropical fry egg, even. Uh, speaking of which, we should... Do I have any more ice? I have some ice. I can try and cool this down a little bit. Maybe. We'll see. See if we can cool some of that down. There's still... Not a lot of salt water there, but wow! Look at this! Look at all this chlorine gas that's now trapped forever. I should... Uh... Well, no, because I need to... Mmm... Okay, you know what? I'm gonna lock that, and then I need to build a... I don't know, can I build a ladder? I'd probably need to build the ladder here, though. Because I can't build it... Well, actually, I could just bring it down here and do that. There we go. Okay, so that they have to come through here, because I think before they've been cutting through here, and I don't want them to do that. Because we spent all this time making this work so perfectly. Oh, they're sopping wet. I uh, know. Oh yeah, how where how do you change their clothes? What are your where is that? Where is that a thing? Uh I need to build more critter condos. And where do I change your clothes? Joshua. Okay, you're hungry. I have ninety-three thousand calories ready for you, my friend. Uh bio. Properties? Blueprint? Oh, restyle. Restyle his outfit. <gasps> Open wardrobe. Oh my. What? Downtime outfit. Oh no. Restyle outfit. Isn't that what I... Oh. Rebel GI jacket. <laughs> Research shirt? Oh, we gotta pick. Who's our researcher? Who is our researcher? Where is... Where do we see? She's our digger. Where's our researcher? I want to pick the nerdiest outfit I can. That will be amazing. Our researcher is currently not researching. Who is it? Lyra. Lyra. Where are you at? Where are you? Is there a place where you can like focus on a duplicate? Can you like click them and be like focus on you or something? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? <laughs> I'm over here. Oh, there you are! There you are! <laughs> Alright, so we went to Blueprint. Restyle. I find the easiest way to track down a dupe is to repeatedly click on the germ icon near the clock cycle. Oh! 
Interesting. <gasps> oh, she was just very excited. Or the stress icon. Oh, nice. That's a good idea. Okay, default top. What do we think? Are we going with the pocket protector? Oh, yeah, this. It's got pocket protector. Uh, gloves? What do we got? Yellow gloves. Frilly leech gloves. Oh, my. White evening gloves. We need lemon gloves. What? I feel like basic yellow gloves. Either icon works. I'm going to start doing that. Yeah. And the germ or the stress icon. That is a really good idea. I'm going to go with white pantaloons. No, black pants. Yeah, that's it. Footwear. What are we doing? Yellow socks. Basic tan shoes. Pink. Purple. Green. Pink yellow. I feel like the tan shoes go better overall. All right. A sign. Nice. Love it. Now we need to... Who... Who else? Oh, we can just pick from here. Abe. He looks like he would wear a Hawaiian shirt. Uh, restyle outfit. I need one person to wear this. Yes. Look at you. Living your best life. We're giving you... White pants. Look. Look at him. He... Just... The best outfit. Purple. 100%. He is ready to go to the club. He is ready. Fabulous. Ooh, or the... Nope, that's it. That's it. That's it. Love it. Love it. Love it. <laughs> I love it. Where is he now? <gasps> there he is. He's on the move. Abe's going to forget he's marooned inside an asteroid. <laughs> He's like on Gilligan's Island. <laughs> I'm so excited to see some of the other cool outfits and stuff that get unlocked. Oh yeah, I was going to show you the race car bed. I cannot wait to get plastic because we get a Grand Prix bed. You can't really see it. It's really hard to see. But yes, we get a red race car bed and everyone's going to get one. When we get comfy beds, it's going to be amazing. Just need glossy Dracos. And then we'll make it happen. But where? I don't want to pull up all the Wee's words, especially when I feel like stuff is melting. Also, I also need to get salt water. Okay, I think that's what I'll do. I'll get a little more salt water. We'll fill this up. And then we'll probably call call it for this episode. And then the next ones, we can get more crazy outfits. And we'll see if we can't break into this natural gas area and get some of the cool recreation stuff going. Yeah, there we go. Finally. Okay, finally it's going to start cooling down. And maybe I should... Well, you know... I'm going to disable this building for now because I feel like this is actually cooled down quite a bit. And then maybe if I put one over here fighting a losing battle? What about here? And then maybe if I just put these like that? Like that. Here we go. Um, oh! I never actually put a tile there. Okay, and then... <gasps> Why are you starving? Time until death? Oh my gosh. Where are the thimble reed seats? Why don't they have any thimble reed seats? Get them the seeds. Get them their seeds. Plant the seeds. Plant them. Oh, they have like one here. Yeah, that's definitely not enough for like 30 pips. Oh no. Where's the... Oh, here are the Oxford seeds. Where are the... Oh, here's another one over here. See? Okay. All right. 
we need to move this up here. Move this up here. What were you guys doing? Oh, she was cuddling that hatchling egg, probably. We could eat that. I don't care about the hatchlings. I'll eat them. That's fine. But the other stuff, I will not eat. Um, okay, somebody plant that really fast because you guys are hungry, and I'm not happy about that. What do you eat? You eat... Fancy decor item? A cuddle pip is classified as a fancy decor item? Harbor tree thimble reed. Huh, okay. We need... Alright, that's growing now. Okay. We need all the thimble reeds. All of them. Where are they? What's in that? I buried some of these in here. <laughs> oh no. Oh, but there's one right there. Okay, there's a couple right there. I can just move these as well. Then These. Right. If even one pip dies from starvation, I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> I cannot have this. Oh, and little perfume. So happy. See? Alright, now we mop this. We fill that. For every tame cuddle pip, you need two wild thimble reeds. Oh, no. Well, that's definitely more than I have right now. Hmm. 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 That's a lot. That's a lot of food. What about arbor trees? I don't really want to feed them arbor trees because then I'll just get a ton more regular pips, but... Hmm. Let's go digging it. Oh, look! Here. You know what? A couple of you are going on a journey, all right? You guys are gonna go out here and explore, okay? Some of you are gonna be free. Uh, whoa. Let's see, how many are that? One, two, three, four. Eh, there's more seeds. They'll plant more seeds, it'll be fine. Two wild arbor trees for every five wild cuddle pips. This is like a science thing that people actually like, wow. It's actually like a, calculation of this. You can set up your bathroom loop to send leftover water into thimble reeds and hydroponic tiles. That is a good idea as well. That is a really good idea. I will also do that next time. For sure. I'm going to add that to the list. What I really want... I want this to be very full, though. Because right now it's full, but it's... ah, It's not as full as I want. <laughs> um, <gasps> I have a sandy st <gasps> Hello! Oh, you're terrifying! Why do you only have pupils? <gasps> oh, you do, they're just yellow. Oh, my! That is. What the hell is that? <laughs> oh, my gosh! <laughs> what? 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 Looks like a robot. Oh my gosh. It's so shiny. The eyes are terrifying. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm plugging numbers into the ranch calculator website to get these numbers. Oh my goodness. I didn't realize there was an actual website for that. Oh my. Well, thank goodness for that. <laughs> Is this even working? It must be, I guess, because it hasn't come up here. Oh, yeah! The other thing I started to do was doing this. That's one thing that somebody made a comment about forever ago that was like, turn the, this into airflow tiles. And I started to do that and got horrifically distracted because that's never happened before. And, <laughs> wow, I have never seen such a thing. I want to read. I want to read it up. <gasps> that's what it turns into. That's terrifying. That was me! That was you! Oh, hooray! <laughs> That's so fun! It's so fun that you guys are like commenting and stuff on YouTube and then I'm getting to implement this in in Twitch. That's so kind of you guys to to watch on both and to, to help me out. I love it. <laughs> Sandy shells are non-hostile creatures unless their eggs are nearby. No kidding. They thrive in water and eliminate germs from any liquid it inhabits. They eat polluted dirt, slime, and rot piles. Uh, ha, ha, ha. The critter's typical life at 100 
Uh, drops raw shellfish? What? I've never raw shellfish, an uncooked chunk of very dead sandy shell. Yum. Oh, cooked in the... <gasps> you can turn it into seafood. Oh my gosh. Put the sandy shell into the infected water and it will eventually disinfect the water. Not the most reliable way, but it works. Yes. For the horrible little germ incident that I had over here. All right. You may die. But that's a sacrifice I'm willing to make because I'll eat you either way. Uh, let's, <laughs> let's do that. Let's maybe break this wall. Maybe break that, break this. And then they're gonna be able to go into there. That's fine. All right, we'll just put all other, all our other friendos in here. Although, I don't think that tropical fry is gonna like it in there. It's, I feel like that's pretty warm for them, but. All right, are we kind of close to getting this? Come on, come on. All right, yeah, cause they can jump up to, yeah, they're gonna be able to jump over into there. It'll be fine. It'll be fine, only mild murder. Oh, is it gonna flood this? Okay, maybe I will put that back. Maybe I will put that back. Okay, yeah, and now I will deconstruct this. And then it'll be much easier for the carbon dioxide to get over here. Hooray! There we go! That's so cool. That's such a cool idea. Hooray, hooray. All right. That, okay, this should be plenty of water in here. And this keeps this here. All right, that is good. That is good. Oh, so happy. Okay, did we? And we moved some of the friends over here. Oh no! Oh, don't you drown. Don't you drown. Oh, they're gonna be sad because they're tame. Do I need to build another grooming station over here? Ugh. The liquid lock you've got there is referred to as a bead lock. Heavier liquids like naphtha and oil make good bead lock. Water tends to get pushed out of the way. Huh. Naphtha? What's naphtha? An oil. Oil would terrify me. Crude oil. Look, it's 91 degrees Celsius. Naphtha is melted plastic? Absolutely not. How do we get melted plastic? That sounds terrifying. <laughs> you want me to send my poor little duplicates into melted plastic? Oh my gosh, clearly that is a level of the game I am, I've never, I've never gotten to, and I'm definitely not ready for. <laughs> Melted plastic, oh my gosh. And oil, ugh, I do need to get plastic sometime, sometime soon. Do we need more pips? No. <laughs> Once you melt it, you can cool it down quite a lot and it will still be liquid. Oh, okay. Well, that's less horrifying. All right. Let's keep with the... Yeah, that's... I, f I feel like as soon as I get to, like, the plastic stage, it just... It all starts to go downhill from there. I'm really trying to... get everything not horrible. And then... And then we'll venture down here. And then once we get this situated, then we'll venture down here into the doom. Oh, look, another fossil. Ugh. Ugh. That's convenient. Oh, look, a Slickster! We can make friends with you, too! Hi, Slickster! Hello! And look at all this. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, I really opened that up. I won't be able to mop that, will I? Mop it quickly! Mop it quickly! <laughs> And then I think there are things in here, aren't there, where you can, like, cool the liquid that gets piped into it, but it outputs a lot of heat? Is that a thing in the... Where is that? Where's that thing? It's like a... Liquid tepid, I guess. No, that warms it. Is it conduction? Uh, thermo aqua tuner? There it is. Cools the liquid pipe through it, but outputs heat in its immediate vicinity. Hmm. 
Let's research that. That could be helpful for us. Maybe for this water, too. It's already hot as death in here, so maybe we could cool that liquid. What are you doing? What are you doing? Last time this happened to a pimp, they died. Don't die on me. Don't die on me! We can't lose you! You stop this right now, sir. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it! Get your act together. Just be up here. Be up here. Look, these pips are happy up here. Be up there. If I come back here, and you've gone missing... Hurry! Hurry! What is... What is level 5? Oh, a symbol reed seed. He's trying to plant that seed. Let it go! Let it go! Be like Elsa and let it go. There we go. Oh my gosh. You silly chinchilla. Oh, we saved him. That was a close one. Chimney Christmas. Maybe instead of moving all the salt water into here, I probably could have used polluted water, but that paired with a steam generator is the most common way to cool things. You need steel first, though. Oh, how do I get steel? I bet it's something I get from down here in hell. Oh, nice! That's filling up. It still isn't buried. That's good. Uh, this is still really... Like, how many of these? Elderly. Uh, no. I feel like that's a crime. <laughs> the steam generator is the most common. Yeah. How do I get steel? I bet I get steel through... Ooh, tungsten. Is it through iron or polluted water off gases, which means it's not great for liquid locks? Oh, that's right. Polluted water gives off gases. You're right. That's smart. That's smart. I'm glad you stopped me. Yes. So that does make sense. Yes, yes. Okay. Whew. Steel is made in the metal refinery with iron, lime, and refined carbon. I wondered what we needed lime for. Because look, you have the eggshell to lime and poke shell molt to lime. And, you know, I was like, why do I need lime? Uh, but it's for steel. In the metal refinery. Do I even have that? I most assuredly do not have that. Oh man, our food is in such a better situation. That is so amazing. That makes me really happy. But yeah, we'll definitely do that. Okay, 